Hi folks, Bob Collins for Edge Hog Dive Gear. In this video, I'm going to be giving you an update about the spread of the Edge Hog available LED dive lights. Now, some of the lights you may have seen before, but I'm going to give you an update about the new range and the newest in the lineup. So stick with me. Now, Edge Hog has continued to broaden its line of LED dive lights. We start with the little LED powered 315 lumen. It's powered by two CR123s. It has a push button on and off, comes with a little wrist lanyard. And it's such a convenient little light and it could easily be used as a backup. Now, along those same lines in the same size, we step up to the DL-19. Now, the DL-19 is very, very nice little light in the fact that it's a thousand lumen and it comes with a battery, it comes with a charger, and it also comes with some extra O-rings. And it is a twist on and twist off light. Now it comes with a lanyard and one of the things I like about these lights is I usually take the lanyard off, put me a split ring on here and a clip and then I mount it right here on my BC so that when I get ready to dive I just twist, turn it on and I make my whole dive, get back on the boat, turn it off and then when I finish my surface interval I'm ready to dive again. That's got some really good power in this battery. I've tested it and it usually lasts about three and a half hours. And so I usually carry an extra battery with me just for the heck of it. It utilizes the very popular 18650 battery. And, uh, but usually one battery does a great job for two tank dive. So, that's really beneficial to me. And again, with a thousand lumen with this light, you can dive on the reef during the day, drop down, maybe you're on a 50, 60 foot reef, and you see those little holes you wanna look in, you're looking for lobster, maybe you're looking for mori or whatever you're looking for to take pictures. And it's really nice. Maybe there's a turtle underneath there sleeping and you wanna get a look at him down there. And it's really bright enough to look under a ledge during broad daylight. So thousand lumen, it's really, really a powerful light. Now, besides that, we also have the one that's a little bigger. This light is called the DL9 and it is a um, a C powered, C cell powered light. It utilizes three C cells, so they're really accessible. Now, this particular light is a little different. The two that I just showed you, these are aluminum construction, and this is an aluminum housing construction with an armored shell, a rubberized armored shell. And so it's really nice. Again, it's a twist on, twist off, and it is also a thousand lumen light. Now, next in the lineup, I'm gonna shift over here to the hog line. And in the hog line, we've got what's known as the DL20. Now, the big deal about the DL20, you're gonna see it right here on the very top. The DL20 utilizes a push button on and off system, not a twist on and off. So it utilizes the same 18650, it utilizes the same charger, the big difference is the push button and push button off. One of the other things about it, it also has a little power indicator 
And I'm going to show you this in a second with the new light. And this power indicator is really neat because when you're able to take a look at that, you'll see what I mean by the fact you're able to monitor your battery life by looking at this little uh, disc around the push button. And that way you know exactly how much power you've got in your battery. Now, it also has some other features that are included in the new light. The new light is called the DL35. Now, the DL35 is this unit right here. I'm gonna get it so you can see it in a close-up. You can see the push button on and off right here. And I'm gonna turn it on. And you're gonna see the power indicator right here on the top. Now, you'll see that this one is glowing red. You can see it up against my shirt. And right now, this beam is 1,600 lumens. It's amazing. And one of the neat things about it is the fact that you can push the button again. I'm gonna shine it right here. Hopefully, I don't overload my picture. So I'm gonna hit it one time. Now I'm down to 50% power. If I hit it again, now I'm down to 15% power. So 50% of the 1,600 is still 800 lumens. 15%, you're just about putting out the same than the little DL15, the 315 lumens. One of the other features I'm gonna show you here is if I push and hold, now it's off if I push and hold again. And now you're seeing a strobing effect by my light. And this is a nice slow strobe. Maybe you want to get somebody's attention underwater. If I push it again, it's going to give me SOS signaling. SOS. SOS. And if I push it again, it's going to give me what I call freaky strobe. And this would really get somebody's attention if you wave this at them underwater in, you know, in the dark and such. Or if you're on the reef during the day and you really needed to get somebody's attention, this would definitely do it. And one of the nice things about it is that it utilizes two 26650 rechargeable batteries that come with the light in the kit and it comes with the charger and all of these come with extra double o-rings now all of these are basically approved down to approximately 70 meters or about 220 feet or so like i've said we got our dl15 315 looms powered by two CR123. Those are not rechargeable batteries. We've got our nice DL19 1100 looms uh, powered by that rechargeable 18650 battery. We've got our DL9 powered by three C size. And this is a thousand loom armored, really nice. I actually use this to walk my dog. And then I've got over here, I've got the DL20, which is our push button thousand loom that uses that nifty 18650. These are readily available today, pretty much anywhere. And again, comes with the recharger. And of course, we've got our big dog, the DL35. And of course, 1600 lumens. You're gonna love it. Thanks for watching. Links will be down below. See you in soon.